Do you remember this scene from the OG Spider-Man? It's the scene where Peter instinctively saves Mary Jane from falling. And correct me if I'm wrong, but we have all imagined ourselves in that scenario. Where we save our high school crush from falling and we become a giga chad in her eyes? Pretty majestic, right? So what is this godly reflex that Peter has and how does it work? Well, apparently it's called the Spidey Sense. However, in the MCU, it's called the Peter Tingle, and they are as different as Quagmire and a psychopath. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Josh from Crazy Kryptonian, and today we'll know the science behind Spider-Man's Spidey Sense. Spider-Man possesses a lot of superpowers, like super strength, super speed, and being super alone, which is pretty common in the superhero universe. But the one thing that sets Peter apart from other superheroes is his Spidey Sense. For those who don't know, Spidey Sense is like a sixth sense that Peter has which allows him to sense the potential danger that could harm him in any way. And with the help of this, Peter predicts and generally dodges the incoming danger. But all of this happens so fast that sometimes Peter doesn't know what happened. It's like instinctive behavior. For example, in boxing, you see how people easily dodge those super fast punches. That's an instinctive behavior because the punches are coming in so fast that there's not enough time for the brain to process the danger. Now, boxers have this instinctive reflex in a humanly possible range. But since Peter is not an ordinary human, his reflexes are on an extreme level. But what makes Peter so special? Well, as the name speaks for itself, he is the Spider-Man. And if you don't know, spiders are very sensitive beings. It is known that in animals, the most sensitive organ is the hair, and since spiders have a density of 40,000 hair per centimeter square, which is 666 times more than humans, they are extremely sensitive. In a scene from the OG Spider-Man, we see how hair is growing on Peter's fingertips after the bite. Those are the tactile hair of a spider. Spiders have tactile hair, which they use as a sense organ to detect vibrations. And with the help of this, they can locate anything from danger to their prey. And this is the same reason why Peter's spidey sense is always shown as a vibration. Now, since Spider-Man is a comic book superhero, he obviously has the extreme version of those powers. And that is probably the reason why Peter can use his spidey sense to such an extent that he can detect and react to the incoming danger so efficiently. So there you have it, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, make sure to like and share this video. Also, if you're new here, make sure to subscribe because we currently need it badly. And while you're here, make sure to check out our other videos as well. This is Josh signing off, and you are watching Crazy Kryptonian. Peace!